Hello everyone, welcome to the sneak peek episode of TMSTML Season 4! This episode is where I go one-on-one -on -one with all the Season 4 contestants, which will all give us a sneak peek clue package. I'm not doing this alone, however, because a special guest will be helping me explain the costumes. Please welcome our new costume designer and the lollipop from last season, Phoebe! Hello everyone, I'm hosting this too. She worked extra hard on these costumes, and the work really paid off. Agreed. They did take a while, but me and my team has definitely been working hard on it. Anyways, be going into three realms of this realm jumper device thingamabob. Did we really name it after the master? Never mind. There's the team good realm, the team bad realm, and the even tasty realm. Should we jump in? Yes! Goodness me, you didn't tell me realm jumping was illegal. Nope, this is the home of the German Shepherd. The German Shepherd is our first team good competitor. German Shepherds are used widely for police dogs internationally. So dressing up as, as a policeman was pretty ideal. They have everything that a police dog would normally have, like Police badges, weapons, uniform, and even a craving for donuts and coffee. Anyways, let's see the sneak peek clue for the German Shepherd. Halt! You've been arrested! <laughs> I'm the German Shepherd. Being the chief of police, I make sure that Mask feels safe and sound. When I got that call that I was selected on being Team Good, I drove right into the Team Good realm. I thrive on justice. And when it's served, it served hot out of the oven. Just because I'm a police doesn't mean I'm always stone cold all the time. In fact, I'm a down-to-earth guy. I started my career as a sketch artist because I'm good at drawing and worked my up to be the Grand Chief. Now it's time for my sneak peek clue. My sneak peek clue is another dog from the Mass Singer, the Rottweiler. What does this have to do with me? You'll find out when I sing my heart out. So, why are we in an art museum? This is the home of the Mona Lisa. So, the Mona Lisa is actually based on the famous painting, the Mona Lisa. It's also based on other costumes based on different artwork, like Marionette from Georgia. But this is more like baby alien based because it's very puppetry based. Agreed. We see a line of cars and they're all painted black. Welcome everyone, I am the Mona Lisa. Being the most famous painting in the world, and the eight-time winner of the, base, uh, the best painting world award, award, I am always open to a little competition with the other paintings. I wanted to be a team good because I want to shake off my team bad past and sprout a new leaf. Ready for my sneak peek clue? My sneak peek clue is a dolly. The Australian one to be exact. exact. Can you paint the picture of what this clue means? This place is very pink. Pink is my favorite color, but this is an excessive amount of pink. This is the home of the fairy. The fairy is a costume based on other fairies in Disney universes like Tinker, Belle, and mostly the fairy godmother. And just like those fairies, the dress is sparkly with fairy wings and a magic wand. So this is a mass that actually can do magic. Hello, my name is Fairy. I am the owner of Fairy Magic Makeup. Under my mask, I own a line of beauty products. And they can make you look stunning. My career has been a wild road. I have been from the most adored, respected person to but one thing I said wrong and then everything changed. 
I was thrown out of every party and my career was almost got destroyed. I'm still clawing my way back up. So when I got called from Team Good, I accepted as, as a second chance for me. Now enough yammering, let's pour out the sleepy clue. My sleepy clue is on YouTube, I have over 3 billion views. And that makes me very magical. <laughs> well, we're, we're in Japan now. And that is the home of the samurai. The samurai is based on the Japanese samurai that was fought a lot in Japan. Samurais are often equipped with armour, and this is quite replicated of original armour, with katanas, and is ready for battle. And I bet its performances will be energetic and crazy, so we should watch out for them. Konnichiwa! I am the samurai, equipped from armour from head to toe and wielding a sharp katana. I am a strong warrior that fights for the good of Japan. When I got that call for Team Good, I came there faster than I could ever run. Now it's time for my sleepy clue. My sleepy clue is the reason I chose the samurai, is because I actually am from Japan. Now we're in an Egyptian desert. I thought Masinga has multiple mummies. They do, but this is better than a mummy. This is the home of the Egyptian god of death himself, Anubis. Anubis is based on the Egyptian god of the same name, but also based on other Anubises like Germany and Russian. But there is definitely differences. Misunderstood me. I am not bad at all. I am the opposite, in fact. My job is to bring people to the afterlife when they die, not actually killing them. So don't worry, one of my mummies sent a scroll that I had been chosen for Team Good, and I happily took that challenge. And I am ready to sing my heart out. Anyways, time for my sneak peek clue. My sneak peek clue is a box of Mike and Ike's. What does this have to do with me? Well, you'll see. Why did you take me to a stone temple? This is the home of the stone golem. The stone golem is based off a lot of Nintendo stone monsters and goliaths, but also has interestingly gemstone teeth for all the birthstones of the twelve. Top top, the stone golem has lots of vine. So he looks a mixture of both cute and very scary. Hello everyone, I am the Stone Golem. Some people say I'm a stone cold person. Well, I'm entirely made out of stone, so that's partially true. Being made out of stone is hard because I don't get that much wiggle room. When Team Dad asked me to join, I said yes. But deep down, I feel more like Team Good. But I'm Team Bad whether I like it or not, so. Now it's time for my sneak peek clue. My sneak peek clue is Zombie. Not that one, but this one. What does this have to do with me? Find out when I break the stage. I know this place. This is Granny's house. I play this game a lot of times. I'm trying my to best to beat hard mode. Now it's time for Granny. I didn't design this one because Granny's based on the horror game character and is actually the exact replica wielding the same bloody baseball bat and ready to take down the team good components. Before they're dead. It's fun! And I like to play hide and seek. 
My sweet pink clue is a tiger. What did this stripey feline have to do with me? Well, you'll see. Ah, I don't really like horror that much. That's why we're here. This is where the clown lives. Clown is based off many kilograms. Clown is based off many kilograms from horror movies and horror shows, horror games. He wields bloody knives and let's just say his performances are probably very gruesome. <laughs> Okay, someone really needs to clean this attic out. This is the home of the evil doll. Again, evil doll is based off horror movies that possess dolls this time. But this one takes more inspiration from rag dolls and voodoo dolls, but yeah, still in the horror vibe. My advice, don't play with this one. Lucas, I think I've had enough of this now. Can we go home? It's a bit too horror for me. This is the last Team Bad contestant. This is the home of Siren Head. Not one I designed, but it's definitely one of the most detailed masks in this show. But he is 15 feet tall and he has to be wheeled everywhere, like kind of like my mermaid because he's kind of so tall. And I've also heard he has to be tied down with ropes because he's that large. Honestly, I don't even know why people would design a mask that big, but yep, it's still probably one of the most elaborate. Don't look up too far, he knows just where you are. Siren Head is coming soon, so sound the alarm. I am Siren Head, being the largest costume ever on the Masked Singer. I have some big shoes, Mr. Phil. Except I, I can't fill in his shoes. <laughs> I joined him Dad. to show how amazing my voice is. And show it over and who is boss. boss. Team Bad has not want anything in all not to make that a change. It's time for my sneak peek clue. Nice. Where the heck did you take me now? This is the home of the gummy bear. The gummy bear is just a giant gummy bear. There's not actually that much to say, but I really enjoy its cute exterior. It kind of reminds me with some inspiration from Care Bears. Oh, I'm a gummy bear. Yes, I'm a gummy bear. Oh, I'm a yummy, tummy, funny, lucky gummy bear. I'm gummy bear. I love repairing things from leaky pipes to broken walls. I can do it all. In fact, I have my own line of repair products you can buy, although all of them are made of gummy. I've never thought of joining the Masked Singer, but hey, I need to get out of the house more often, so yeah. Anyways, my sneak peek clue is... Taylor Swift. What is this sneak peek? It's a clue of my favorite singer have to do with me. You'll find out soon. This is a very big strawberry farm. That's 
The home of the strawberry. Well, the strawberry is based off a strawberry. But, interestingly, the leaves do make up a dress for this one. And she is very, very positive and very, very smiling. So she is really, really cute. Hello, I am Strawberry. I am sweet, cute, and adored by everyone. I chose the strawberry because, well, strawberries are one of my favorite foods. Another thing that I like is love. I enjoy watching my favorite couples on TV. And secretly, I have a crush on one of the other contestants on the show. And I'll tell you who it is when the season starts. My sneak peek clue is grapes. I don't like grapes. She always steals the men I like. And she is not cool. And that's why she got last. <laughs> Whoa, that is a lot of chocolate. The chocolate mousse. The chocolate mousse is based on the dessert and we got more creative with it. Interestingly, chocolate mousse's design is taken off other sweets because he's largely based on Willy Wonka. Hello guys, I'm the Chocolate Moose. Being made out of chocolate means everyone tries to eat me, which isn't comfortable in my opinion. But enough of that, I joined Team Tasty because I want to show it's what matters on the inside and not on the outside. So my sneak peek clue is Prince. What does this have to do to me? What does this have to do with my real identity? We'll find out soon. This isn't some flying spaghetti cult, is it? No, but this is the home of the spaghetti. The spaghetti is based on a real ball of spaghetti. He has meatball eyes and obviously he's got lots of spaghetti coming out. But he's also wearing a chef's outfit to go with the fact that he's obviously made quite skillfully from chefs. On top of spaghetti, all covered with cheese. I am spaghetti. And I like to go big or go home. During my career, I took on some egos in society, like the massive ones. Though sadly now, I am not as shining as I used to be. However, joining Team Tasty makes me feel special again. Now my sneak peek clue is I was born in the state of New York. So what does this have to do with my real identity? Find out soon. Peanut butter jelly time. I gotta admit, this is kind of new to me. I'm not American. Yep, this is the home of the peanut butter and jelly. This is a duo costume. One is based on a jar of peanut butter and one is based on a jar of jelly or jam. Apparently it's a delicious combination, so they're perfect for each other. But I've never actually tried this. It's peanut butter jelly time, peanut butter jelly time. Hello everyone, I'm peanut butter. And I'm jelly. And we are perfect together. We both love each other so much. And join together because we are perfect together. It's time for our clue. Our sneak peek clue is, this isn't my first time here, but it's jelly, so we decided to team up. That was a lot of fun. Yes, though I wasn't a very big fan of the horror things, clown. Don't worry, I'm not gonna hurt you. I just remind, want to remind you that you're forgetting something. What are we forgetting? A sneak peek performance. Oh yeah, clown, why don't you do your sneak peek, sneak peek performance? I can't speak normally today. Okay. Oh, a perfect day. I'm in Maskey land, and I'm meeting Firefly here soon. And it's seen good day, so everything is half off. Glad I got those tickets in the mail. Nothing can possibly ruin Team Good Day. Team Good Day, you ask? Ah, oh, it's the clown! That's right. <laughs> Now, 
it's Team Bad Day, and Nasty Land is now Clown Land. <laughs> Get out of here, you stupid prince. It's time for me to, to be the bad guy. So I'm a tough guy. Just can't get enough guy I'm that bad type Make your girlfriend mad tight I'm the bad guy Bad guy Oh, I'm a music, I'm a music, I'm a music Now red's your bloody now sleeping I'm on my TV to scraping Around like no one knows Think I'm so creamy now Versus on both your knees for me Don't say thank you or please I do what I want when I'm wanting to my soul So cynical So I'm a tough guy like a really rough guy Just can't get an off guy Just can't get an off guy I'm the bad type Make you mama so tight Make you go from mad type But seduce you dead type I'm the bad guy I'm the bad guy Now that was an amazing sneak peek performance. Anyways, see you all on the stage. Goodbye, and remember to like and subscribe for more amazing content.